After being closed for three months, the Louisiana Children's Museum finally opened its doors last week. Photojournalist Derek Waldrip shows us how the museum is trying to keep kids safe while having fun. We were so excited to be able to reopen our doors and welcome back children and families to the museum. We closed the 15th of March, and so we were closed for a quarter of a year, and it um, it's very, very painful. The financial hit to the museum has been horrendous. Um, so there is the need to run a business in a, in a good way and to run a museum with an entirely new set of procedures where safety and health are topmost of mind. Well, we are visiting from Kentucky. So we're always people who travel. We have a camper, we go all over the country. And so for them to be stuck you know, unable to explore, unable to like see new things. It's, it's hard for me even. Honestly, out of all the places to go, this is probably one of the better ones. So they're being pretty careful. So we're open for two hour block of time and we close for an hour. In that one hour break, we're cleaning. It's a deep clean of anything that people may have touched. Adults have to wear masks and kids nine years of age and older. We had memberships, we got them in December. Um, and haven't had a lot of use so far, but we thought we'd come and try it out. They haven't seen other kids, really, <laughs> in months, so just being able to like see people besides us is kind of important. This is like the only thing they've done, like out of the house, pretty much. Come on back, come on in. Unless we're gonna stay in a bubble completely, you make it as safe as you can. Until we get a vaccine, we're going to take some risk. 